Well, this isn't exactly the game um, had intended. However, we tried. <laughs> we tried. Baby. Baby. The blue one? Here, I have, I have one more on my face. You want to get it off? You want to eat. Yeah, it's itchy. Oh. Oh, it's Thank you. I think that's all of them. Yeah. Yeah, that's all of them. Me. That's the mantis with he all the colors. Wow. Yeah, he's spreading his wings. Wow. You think he's gonna fly? Yeah. Oh, spider. He's black. Yeah, he is, he is black. But then look, his back is blue and red. Yeah. yeah. Should we do the itsy bitsy? Yeah. Okay, ready? And do it with me. The itsy bitsy spider went up. The water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. No, weevil. Yeah, it is a weevil. You're right. <gasps> Who's eating the bee? The ant. The big black ant is eating the bee. Hello, nice to meet you. <laughs> the siren and look you're wearing your fire fireman pajamas oh no uh oh that's okay Oh, are you looking for bugs? Yeah. I don't think there's bugs on these cards, honey. Yeah. There are? Oh, look, there are some bugs. There's a dragonfly. Whoa. Oh. like that, we are now building. Huh? You wanna build? Yeah. All right. Hello guys, good morning. I'm setting up to make some oatmeal. I'm sure William will help me. Um, he's been really into helping me cook lately and he's been getting good about keeping his hands to himself, you know, when the oven's on and like knives are around and stuff. So it's not as stressful, but I still try and get everything out and like prepped ish before he comes over so there's no lull period where he can touch stuff or want to eat like the entire bag of brown sugar when all we need is a sprinkle on our oatmeal. So I'm sure you will see him ask for that at some point. <laughs> but we're just hanging out today pretty much. Look at this shirt guys, look at this shirt. <laughs> I bought this shirt, I don't even know where honestly, but I bought it <laughs> back when William was really little. I saw it and I'm like, I need this for if I ever get pregnant again, because this is the mood, okay? That is the mood every day, especially uh, the past couple days. So I'll make this ramble quick because I don't know how long he's gonna last without breakfast. Um, but we, let's see, my last vlog, we did a little bit of nesting and I said, I need the nesting bug, right? 
Well, literally the nesting bug hit. I was ready to organize my entire house, clean my entire house, but we got sick. Well, William and I got sick. Will never did. And of course I got it the worst and ugh, it's just being sick and pregnant is not fun. It was just, it was just like a throat sinus thing, but I just was achy and gross. No fever, no like vomiting or anything. Thank goodness. But still just not a fun couple days. And of course that's when I was like, I want to clean. But my next coming videos will be nesting. We will be getting some nesting done. Other than a Q and A is also coming. So if you have any questions about this pregnancy, I, I've already gotten a couple of my DMs, which I will be adding into the video. But um, if you have any questions, put them down in the comments below or DM me over on Instagram and I will answer a question in one of my next videos. Okay, I'm gonna finish getting this together. <sighs> I'm out of breath already. Also, it's like only 8 a.m. and I'm already tired. <laughs> William, oh, thank goodness we have him on a good schedule right now. He's been going to bed around like 7.30, which is amazing, amazing, if you guys have known our sleep history with him. But now he wakes up earlier, and Mama doesn't really sleep very well at night being pregnant, so getting up earlier has been a little rough. But that's okay. It's really nice to have that, you know, alone time with Will after he goes to bed or just alone time with myself to zone out, you know to zone. <laughs> okay, let's get to cooking. Does mom have enough room to fit these days? I do, okay. Here's our apple. Remember what we do first? What do we do? We take the peel off, right? Because William doesn't like the red peel. You wanna touch it? You can eat it if you want, but you, know, you don't like it in your oatmeal, right? Really? Oh, be careful, peelers are sharp. Hmm? Yeah, only mommies can use knives and peelers, right? Because it gets sharp. You and Dada? And Dada. Mom and Dad. William can do it when he's older. Would you like to throw all the peels away? Yeah. Okay, hold them tight and they go in the trash. Huh? Okay, do you want to munch on this? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So mommy's gonna cut it up into pieces, right? So we can go on our oatmeal. You're eating that one, you're eating that piece. I have a knife out, hands have to be by ourselves, right? We don't wanna get hurt. Is that a good apple core? Let me see it. How many bites did you take? You took three bites already? Wow. What does the red light mean? We don't touch, right? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> yeah hot, hot. Can you say hot? Yeah. Yeah, we don't touch because it's hot. Okay, and the mommy puts this in. Apples go in. Uh oh, I dropped one. Yeah. You hear it? What's it doing? What's the noise? called a sizzle. Can you say sizzle? Sizzle, sizzle. The apple. The apple is cooking so it makes the noise. Don't touch the pan. Cinnamon, woohoo, good job. Can you put the, cut, the top back on? What do we do now? Oatmeal. Oatmeal, yes, we do our oatmeal. So we need our measuring cup. It's gray, is this looking like it? <laughs> Your apple's in there? Okay, let's get our oatmeal. Good job, big scoop, right? We like the big scoop. We put it in. Too <gasps> Say too hot. You're silly. Oh. <laughs> you hooked it on there? Yeah. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> no. Yes. No. Please. Oh my no. <laughs> yes, the brown sugar is the last one. We we don't need to eat it. We have to put a little in our oatmeal. 
Uh-oh. Can you get your glasses for me so they don't break? Thank you. Whoa. Should we put them back on your face? No. Apple. Yay! Hey guys, it is actually the next day. Yesterday I was trying to chat with you guys and William was just not having it. He's like, Mom, we've been playing all morning. Let's continue this play. So I said, all right, we'll chat tomorrow. Bonnie, you okay? Now Bonnie's not having this chit chat. Apparently I'm not allowed to talk to you guys. Um, but to be quite honest, I don't even remember what I was gonna chat with you guys about yesterday, but, <laughs> but I just got home from my last OB appointment, so I figured we'd have a little pregnancy update chit chat. I'm actually on my ball. I finally got my exercise ball out, and man, it is helping with my hips and my back. Not completely, obviously, but it is definitely helping. Glad I finally got it out, but Boy, has it been just not as relaxing and a, and a tad stressful because William just wants to bounce on it all day long. It's been fun, but I try and hide it when I can. So it's kind of nice he's not home right now. I can just stretch my hips as I want. But I am currently um, 25 and a half weeks pregnant. And I just had my last OB appointment, like I said. Everything is looking good. Blood pressure is good. Yes, my blood work came back looking good, so that's good. Um, and other than like gaining a little bit of extra weight, which I already told you guys in my last update, the doctor is happy, um, heart rate looked awesome, and I'm just, I don't know, I'm just happy. I think, um, well, I don't really wanna jinx it, but the exhaustion, I'm hoping, is fading because it was, and then we got sick. And then I was like slammed right into just being so busy after being sick. We had a wedding, a baby shower. We um, had already planned a trip to Ikea to get some stuff and like just kind of back to back things. Um, so yesterday, I think it was kind of like a recoup day and that's why I was so exhausted. But today I woke up feeling pretty good, knock on wood, pretty good. Um, I think I'm also, I was adjusting to William's new schedule of waking up early. So hopefully, hopefully we can stay on this schedule and not go back and forth. What else was I going to tell you guys? Oh, like I said, we went to Ikea and we went there to look at dressers. Guys, what in the world? Okay. A lot of the dressers are short. I never realized how short a lot of dressers are, especially there at Ikea. Um... And like now looking online, I know to check the height and like really hone in on the height because this is gonna go into the boys room. They will be sharing a room. Um, so we just need a bigger dresser in there. And I don't wanna be having a changing station on top of a dresser that's like short and I have to bend over and you know, hurt my back. So I don't know, Ikea just didn't have anything that was at a good height that wasn't like, I don't know, out of our price range, I guess. <laughs> So we didn't get much other than a couple little things here and there. And got a new rug for this room, which I like, but here, I'll show you guys. I like it, um, but it is dark. So it shows like all the crumbs, <laughs> all the crumbs when there are some. And you know, with a toddler, there are some. Um, I literally just vacuumed it yesterday morning and then this morning again, like it needed it already. So I'm like, great. Great, but it looks nice and I like it. Our other one was just getting old. We literally bought it when we moved in, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, that's all we got at Ikea. It was kind of a bummer not to get a dresser though. I think I did find one I like at Lowe's online. So I'm going to probably order that because I want to get the boys, the boys, plural. Ah, it's just so weird to think about. Their room situated very soon. Like I said, I want to get into some nesting. I have done some. Um, that full long day that I told you guys about, um, that William went to grandma's and grandpa's, Will and I got a ton done. We literally organized the heck out of his toys. And I made sure to organize it in a way that there's a little room to grow in each like 
bin or whatever. So hopefully we don't have to redo it anytime soon. We'll see. I'm just gonna try and keep up with it with toy rotations. I might be a little crazy and go back through and um, just write a list of where everything is. I know that kind of sounds nuts, but I don't want to dig in different bins for different things if I don't have to. Like right now I remember where every single stinking toy is, but I might forget where a specific little Montessori toy is in the future. And William sometimes asks for specific things. So I might just make a master list of like, okay, purple bin, this bin, blah, 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 blah. Um, but toys are done. And that was a biggie because it takes just a while and you can't, you can't do it with William home. And then throughout the past week or so, um, since I've talked to you guys, I've just done like, you know, like a little junk drawer or go through all the mail that I've just said I need to file type of thing. Um, just little tasks that needed to get done. So now I'm ready to head into the bigger tasks and mark them off the list. So we will be doing that. So I'm gonna get to work on that and you guys will be seeing that very soon, probably after the Q&A. So don't forget to drop your questions below. Probably be answering it on the ball. This freaking exercise ball is the best. I always forget how much I love it until I bring it back out. So I will, ooh, it's windy outside. You guys hear that? That's kind of nuts. Anyway, that's going to be the end of the vlog for today, and I will see you all next time. Bye.